Tell me what you have to go and drive me so crazy. Now I'm feeling lost without you, and I just can't be without you, baby. Want you all night long. Want you all night long. Tell me what you have to go and drive me so crazy. Now I'm feeling lost without you, and I just can't be. Hey beautiful, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily if you are new and today I'm going to be sharing with you lots of motivation. We are cleaning and decorating my house and I'm so very excited about it and let me tell you I needed this motivation. Without you guys I would not have gotten this stuff done. Oh my, I had to get my makeup on, I had to get dressed and in order to be productive and I have lots to share with you in this video so I hope you guys are going to enjoy it and are excited. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new so I can continue to inspire and motivate you through DIY decorating and lifestyle videos like this. So get that to-do list out, let me know what's on it, and let's get started. Tell me, why'd you have to go and drive me so crazy? Now I'm feeling lost without you and I just can't be without you, baby, won't you all night? So we actually had family come to town this weekend and we enjoyed having them and so the laundry that I just folded was not dirty it was clean it's just I had to make room for them to do their laundry before they left so I am going to be cleaning the guest room basically cleaning up all the makeover stuff that I did for the master bedroom if you haven't seen that video I'll leave it linked down below but I made it over and did all the details with you and I just love the way it turned out so now it's time to actually clean up the mess the part that I don't always share in the videos you guys get to see it today so I hope you enjoy the real life encouragement in here Now we are going to get started with the decorating part. I just got to clean off the coffee table. If you cannot tell, we love to play games and build things here. And so I just need to clean it off and then I'm going to get to decorating and share with you a lot of different products that I recently found that I love, 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 and they're such a good deal. And I, of course, will have them all linked down in the description box below, but they are so beautiful and I can't wait for you to see them. different types of eucalyptus off of Amazon and I really like actually all of them they're all a little bit different so this first one has
has that traditional look that you see at most of the stores, Walmart, Hobby Lobby, um, Target and everything. And these are smaller sprigs, but they're great for accent pieces or making your own wreaths or things like that. Well, then I found this one and people, all the reviews were like, oh my gosh, it's so real looking. It is definitely super real looking. I'm gonna take one out so you guys can see it. And they even feel real. They have that eucalyptus feel to them. So I just want you to see the difference between the two. This one's definitely more of a vibrant green, but it's very natural looking. So if you want that fresh eucalyptus look, definitely get these. There's a couple different styles. Um, I ordered another one that has the longer leaves and they're just gorgeous. I mean, gorgeous. I just love these. So if you're in the market for these, I will have them linked down below. Everything, these are fabulous. I am so happy I found them. And each of these bundles was, I believe, around $10 and you get uh, between eight and 10 of the stems a piece, which is really good, so. Oh, I know. The pink cloth that I am using to wipe everything down is my general purpose e-cloth and I love them because you only use water, there's no chemicals in it or anything and they work extremely well. There is a bathroom, a kitchen set, and just a general purpose. I have the dry cloths. I'm collecting more and more of them and I really do enjoy them because they are very nice and they are reusable and you just wash them in your normal laundry, no extra special things to them and then you just continue to use them. You get 300 washes out of them. So. They will last you a really long time and again there's no chemicals involved or anything like that the tall jar is from hobby lobby and then the small one is from target hearth and hand collection something else that i ended up finding was this beautiful eucalyptus garland something just fell but this is gorgeous because they have intertwined a whole bunch of different types of the leaves and I love this it is so full it's a six footer it's gorgeous so much better than what you find at Hobby Lobby oh my goodness or all the other craft stores it's just gorgeous you guys um, and it definitely would say um, if I'm going to compare the two So again, here is the real looking one versus the faux, fake one, whatever you want to call it. Um, and then these leaves match this one really, really well. So but you could totally intermix these two together. They're so pretty, you guys. I cannot get over how real they are. So you have the two different leaves. These are great for table settings, um, just year round. I am loving the neutrals lately. And just having a very calm, peaceful home is what I want to have. I don't want to, you know, I want, I don't want to add some seasonal decor in there, but I'm just finding so much joy in the simplicity of just changing a few things, but not going way over the top the way I used to. So I just think these are such a good find. Um, and then there is, sorry, like the worst packaging ever. Um, the real looking garland and they've mixed both of the style leaves on here and the branch is real this is only five feet though so it's a little bit skinnier and it's it's full but it's not as full as the other one so this one this one's easier to manipulate and move this one's a little stiffer so you can see the difference okay and I mean again this is just more natural and this one you just need to kind of wave the branches you know each side but again it feels real it looks real i mean by golly it's just gorgeous so i'm going to figure out which one of these i want on the mantle um and go from there <laughs>
Another new addition I got are these pillow covers and I love them. They're so pretty. They are more of a soft creamy white. They're not ultra white. So just keep that in mind. Um, but they are so pretty and the zipper is hidden. They have a couple different colors in them as well. And I just love the style. I want to pick up some more of them because I just think they're so pretty. And again, I rather I'm trying to buy more pillow covers versus pillows. That way I can just easily store the pillow covers. They're not as bulky as the pillow inserts. But most of my pillow inserts came from Ikea and, I, and they're just really nice quality. Um, but I will leave a few linked down below for you in case you are interested, of course. The chair and the pillows all came from Costco and then the blanket came from Amazon. I tell you, I'm loving Amazon Prime, <laughs> but all these signs are what I've made. I have the videos linked down below if you want to go watch and how to make them. But now I decided to actually clean off the chairs with my new uh, little uh, fabric head for the couches. This came with my Dyson V8, which I love this vacuum. I upgraded from a V6 to a V8. Um, and. I'm just so happy like it makes the world of a difference and especially with like furniture that does not have covers like these chairs being able to vacuum them is really necessary when you have dogs or animals you can see how much this hair was just stuck on the outside this chair wasn't as bad because I usually keep a little blanket on it um, to keep the kids from making it super messy oh here you are face to face in this trashy bar Another glass and I am going places makes me laugh above the irony this side chair had so much dog hair and lint on it, I could not believe it. So I was really happy I could just vacuum this off. This is an Ikea chair, so I could easily just remove it and wash it, but vacuuming is just that much quicker and I don't have to do any more laundry. Speed into your drum And I'm blinded by the sunshine in your eyes Not thinking twice in my this down Although I know you're all I want something so bad my sweaty palms reveal a warning i should hear but i don't care you drive me mad i know the truth and run to you so we could drive away you'll hear me say everything is gonna be okay i don't need nobody else so such a you Can't help myself You know too well I need you close Can't help myself Try to stop the fire under your spell Can't help myself So as I said earlier, I wanted to go for a very soothing, um, calming vibe in the home and I feel like I achieved that just keeping very natural tones in the house for winter time still because there's tons of snow outside and then just adding a couple subtle hints of Valentine's Day in there, nothing too too much, but just enough to spruce it up a little bit. But I'm loving the creams and the grays in the house for winter time. You'll have to tell me if you are decorating for winter or for Valentine's Day. Let me know down below. A lot of you have enjoyed my last year's winter decorate with me, so thank you so much for watching that video.
one who doesn't. Resilience. Your shadow stretching on the floor While the sun gets low I got a feeling that the glow deep inside my core Needs to breathe to flow We push it right on through I know you need it too because we have been working hard right from the very start I am using the e-cloth on my cabinets. These work really good too in the kitchen. I love the stainless steel one. They get rid of all the grease and grime. They don't leave any streaks. And if you haven't tried the glass cleaner one, oh my goodness, you don't need any sprays or anything. So you're not adding all those chemicals to your home and causing your nasal passages to go berserk. We have a lot of allergies in our home. So it's nice to be able to use something that doesn't, you know, use a lot of fragrances. I'm allergic to fragrance and so are the kids as far as their skin goes. So I'm I'm just trying to slowly transfer everything over to more green options. Went the extra mile in every race. We are duty bound. And here I'm just switching out my winter wreath for the one that I made in a DIY. And I just love that it says cuddle weather. It's perfect because it's like 30 degrees outside and you legit want to cuddle. So now I'm just going to finish up vacuuming before I start mopping. I was so excited that my e-cloth mop came in, which I'm really happy about. And then I also got the bathroom cleaning set, which I'm really excited about. I didn't have that one yet, so I'm excited to try those out and let you know how well they work. But this um, bar actually extends to different lengths, so if you're really tall like me, you're good to go. Or if you're short, you have an option too. But I just like the fact that you can rewash these things and they're very simple to use. There's no chemicals, like I said, it's just water and I've been really liking how well they've been working in my home. So if you haven't done so yet, make sure to leave me a comment. Let me know how you are doing. How are your New Year's goals going? Are you accomplishing them? Have you changed your mindset to be really positive? Because I find that that has really helped me change things because let me tell you, I get down too. And this day, I didn't feel like cleaning or getting anything done. And I was able to accomplish a lot. And by that, I was able to help hopefully motivate and inspire you in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed sharing it with you. Of course, I'll leave the e claws and all the decor pieces I share with you in the description box below. I hope you have an amazing day. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next one. Hey.